You and I share a common curiosity. We want to know how things work. We want to know how to make things work better. And perhaps no one embodied this curiosity more than the Nobel Prize winning physicist and celebrated teacher Richard Feynman. Feynman had a superpower. And that superpower was his innate genius. Asked by the US government to study the 1985 Space Shuttle Challenger disaster, Feynman discovered a critical design flaw in the O-ring seal. He figured it out before anyone else. And to help illustrate what happened to the shuttle, Feynman immersed an O-ring in a glass of ice water, mimicking the below freezing temperatures the evening before Challenger's fateful launch. And a few minutes after removing the ring from the ice water, cracks began to form. Those cracks, sadly, spell the tragic demise of the Challenger. Feynman, Einstein, Edison, Da Vinci, Tesla, they were all the same. Geniuses with a nearly superhuman ability to understand how and why things work. Most of us, of course, are not Feynmans or Einsteins. We lack that level of insight. And that is precisely why we, as engineers, need simulation. Simulation is our superpower. Multiphysics simulation gives us the ability to see and to understand why things work or don't work in the real life. It's like being able to see inside a product and instantly grasp the physics behind it. It's like being able to see into the future. Simulation enables you to innovate as never before, to engineer what's ahead. And that's exactly what happened with the space shuttle program after the Challenger accident. NASA used simulation they used ANSYS to redesign the O-ring seals. This superpower that is simulation has become the great equalizer. Simulation gives us the optimal design for a product. It shows us which materials will make a product more durable. True multi-physics simulation enables us to make more informed trade-off decisions when developing products, whether the product is a race car or a mobile phone or a medical device. But it does more than that. Simulation helps organizations drive both top-line revenue growth and achieve significant cost savings simultaneously. With simulation, companies can rapidly innovate. They can easily validate design ideas and they can improve cycle times. It enables you to launch more of the right products and to do so at a faster pace. Now in times like this, Simulation also acts as a force multiplier, helping companies get more impact from tight R&D budgets. Simulation gives engineers the tools to evaluate multiple design options cost-effectively and in parallel by reducing or even eliminating the need for costly physical testing. And that is particularly relevant during this global crisis when some engineers cannot get access to their labs to physically test their products. During simulation world, which is the largest event dedicated to engineering simulation on the planet, you'll hear examples of companies across industries that are engineering what's ahead through the power of simulation. But these aren't just engineering stories. Rather, they are true tales of business transformation. You'll hear from GE Healthcare, which is re-engineering its product line to reduce costs while maintaining the quality of its healthcare solutions for emerging markets. Simulation plays a key role in optimizing products up front to virtually eliminate physical testing before production. You'll hear from Lennox, which is using simulation to rapidly develop virtual prototypes of its high-end air conditioning and refrigeration products. Multiphysics simulation is also helping Lennox launch state-of-the-art product lines while reducing materials costs. You'll hear from other industry leaders like Intel, like Baker Hughes, which are using ANSYS simulations to transform their businesses, to transform their products, to transform their brands. You know that in a connected world where good news and bad news can travel at the speed of light, your product is your brand. And whether the brand is a century old, like the Robert Bosch company, or a startup like Analog Photonics, simulation can be a key differentiator a superpower. And that superpower has been available to organizations for half a century now. ANSYS and engineering simulation have come a long way since our founding 
50 years ago, this month, in a farmhouse in Western Pennsylvania. Just as your organizations and industries have undergone massive transformations in the last half century, so have ANSYS and simulation. Yes, the laws of physics remain immutable, but how we understand them, how we tap into them to develop better products faster and less expensively, that has changed dramatically. But what hasn't changed is ANSYS's laser focus on simulation. We remain a pure play simulation solutions provider, unlike other vendors who've become distracted with other technologies. Our simulation portfolio is the broadest and deepest in the market and is supported by a global network of channel partners. ANSYS customers can simulate everything from structural mechanics to computational fluid dynamics to electromagnetics and from photonics to material properties to semiconductors to entire systems. At the risk of bragging, ANSYS simulation solutions are the gold standard for the industry. We pride ourselves on our ongoing focus on accuracy. That's what you expect from us. And that is why our products are helping customers solve the most vexing product challenges imaginable. That is why undergraduate students are taught ANSYS. That is why ANSYS electromagnetic solutions have been referenced nearly 5,000 times in prestigious IEEE publications. And that is why we continue to invest in our portfolio to strengthen our offerings through both organic development and through the acquisition of complementary technologies that are critical to the success of your products. Where our customers are running simulations is also changing. Driven by the COVID-19 pandemic, engineers working from home are embracing the cloud for high-performance computing resources required for fast simulation. That convenience, that customer-first attitude is a hallmark of ANSYS. Customers now have the flexibility to port their licenses from an office workstation to their computers at home. They can work on premises, in their own data centers, or on the cloud. And they can choose the right licensing options to meet their business's unique needs. As a result, simulation is more accessible and it is driving more innovation. Breakthroughs like autonomous vehicles, 5G communications, the industrial Internet of Things, the electrification of automobiles and airplanes. These innovations are only possible through the power of simulation. Take autonomous vehicles. Given the sophistication, complexity, and safety-critical nature of these products, it's clear that they cannot be developed without the extensive use of simulation. You've probably heard that validating autonomous cars would require physically driving over 8 billion miles. And that's a task that cannot be achieved without the use of simulation. We're seeing increased interest from automotive OEMs, aerospace and defense companies, and their entire supply chains to make these next generation vehicles a reality. And while we can debate when autonomous vehicles will take to our roads and airways, the simulation work around autonomy is paying dividends in the form of ongoing improvements in vehicle features, safety, and efficiency. ANSYS is working with BMW to develop a simulation tool chain for virtually testing and validating automated driving systems. This tool chain will support BMW's autonomous engineering efforts in areas like scenario creation and variation, closed loop simulation, and data lineage. In doing so, BMW will make a technological quantum leap and support the safety of automated driving systems and will launch its highly automated BMW iNext in 2021. 5G communications is another breakthrough being made possible by simulation. With connection speeds 100 times faster than our current cellular connections, and even 10 times faster than home broadband services, 5G has the potential to not only change our lives, but to disrupt entire industries and to enable entirely new ones. To make 5G a reality, though, the industry requires new technologies that can only be developed with the help of simulation. For example, our solutions enable 5G engineers to model complete antenna arrays, a task that was previously computationally prohibitive. Our 5G track showcases example after example of simulation enabling a number of 5G technologies for organizations 
like the US Air Force Research Lab, which is using ANSYS to help build novel workflows to develop trusted and assured microelectronics. Modelithics will discuss how 3D simulation is required to accurately predict a circuit's performance when being used in 5G applications. And Ozone Engineering will highlight how simulation plays a critical role in the design and testing of 5G antenna arrays. The Industrial Internet of Things promises to drive unprecedented levels of efficiency, productivity, and performance. By enabling digital twins and smart connected products, simulation is helping to ensure that the promise of the industrial IoT is kept. Longtime customer Siemens will discuss how our two companies are working together on a complete workflow to generate digital twins of devices to simulate and predict their behaviors. The holistic approach allows Siemens to arrive at answers in seconds instead of hours, enabling users to accurately predict the behavior of real-world twins and to make more informed decisions quickly. Finally, simulation is playing a key role in the electrification of vehicles. As electric vehicle popularity surges amongst consumers, automotive industry leaders are making electrification development a top priority. This has sparked a major shift in production trends with numerous all-electric models set to hit the highways soon. To advance their research and development initiatives, automakers must leverage comprehensive multi-physics simulation. That enables companies to gain an edge on their competitors by bringing new products to market with unmatched speed. Using simulation, Volkswagen Motorsports engineers optimized their car battery's electrical efficiency and tested it on a virtual racetrack, enabling the car to shatter records at physical courses around the world. Simulation has been pivotal for managing the battery's temperature and maximizing the car's aerodynamic performance within these exceptionally demanding driving conditions. As you can see, simulation, and in particular, simulation from ANSYS, is being used extensively to develop the products of tomorrow. Companies are taking advantage of simulation in new and exciting ways, in areas outside of its traditional role as a verification and validation tool. You've already heard me talk about the role of simulation for digital twins. During this conference, you will also hear how simulation is moving upstream to the ideation phase of the product lifecycle with ANSYS Discovery Live. And you will learn how companies are using simulation during the additive manufacturing process. These organizations understand that bringing simulation into ideation, into manufacturing, into operations, is no longer just an option. It is an imperative. And of course, simulation and ANSYS alone cannot turn these visions into reality. We are fortunate to have a robust partner ecosystem to help support our customers as they engineer what's ahead. One of those key partners is Microsoft, which is also the diamond sponsor of Simulation World. Our ANSYS cloud offering, where we empower customers to access high-performance computing on demand, runs on Microsoft Azure. We've also partnered with Microsoft to make it easier for customers to adopt and deploy digital twins. Through this partnership, manufacturers that model and connect assets using Azure digital twins can optimize asset operations using physics-based models produced by ANSYS Twin Builder. That enables users to slash product maintenance costs and speed high-quality products to market. Microsoft has several presentations during Simulation World highlighting the depth of our relationship and I encourage you to attend them to learn more about this dynamic partnership. And you will hear from our other partners like SAP and PTC and Autodesk and Rockwell Automation, as well as from such customers as Renault, Qualcomm, Seagate, BAE Systems, and many others. These organizations have embraced the superpower that is simulation. And they're using it to transform their businesses. They're following in the footsteps of Richard Feynman, seeking to understand how things work and to how to make those things work even better. I am immensely proud of what simulation and ANSYS have achieved over the last half century. But I'm even more excited about how you 
our customers are engineering the future. You are pioneering life-saving, patient-specific medical procedures. You're connecting people a world apart with the newest consumer electronics. You're developing technologies to stem the tide of climate change. You're eliminating automobile accidents with the promise of autonomous driving. And you're helping humanity to once again reach the stars. That future is now in your hands. Take what you learn here at Simulation World from the hundreds of presentations and fireside chats and discussions of best practices. Go explore, learn, question, and then use simulation to become superheroes in your organizations. Develop the products of tomorrow. Disrupt entire industries. Make the impossible possible. Engineer what's ahead.